Welcome back to Yoshi Entertainment, everybody. So this story just came out not too long ago, and quite frankly, it rubbed me the wrong way so badly. Like, I am really disturbed, and I don't even really know what to say, to be honest. But so recently, if you haven't heard, it came out that Selena Gomez had a documentary that she put out in her supposed best friend, Francia Razia, and who also donated a kidney to her. Which was, this was years ago when this happened, it was snubbed from the documentary. Now, a quick summary of um, what happened back in the day. Selena Gomez had some problems. I think lupus was one of them, and she needed a new kidney. Her best friend at the time, um, Francia Razia, donated her kidney to her now a lot of people were like listen that was like above and beyond because i don't know a whole whole lot of people who would donate a kidney to their friend or to their best friend yeah family member sure but there's not a lot of people that would do that so y'all keep that in mind she donated a kidney to this girl to help her while she was struggling with her health and just recently in an interview that selena gomez had she said something along the lines of the only friend i have in the industry is taylor swift now me personally i think that she should have mentioned francia at least she should have said well you know what let me take that back i have two good friends best friends uh, the other which is francia who gave me her kidney whenever i was having health problems back in the day but she didn't say that and so a lot of people were bringing it to attention they were saying i mean you could have mentioned francia because of, you know what she did i'm not saying every waking moment like praise her like she's your god because you know only you know yeshua is your god but she should have mentioned that girl that's the least that she could have done but i saw some comments and y'all when i said i was disturbed by how people really think out there they were basically people saying that oh well she didn't really have to mention her taylor swift is in the industry it's her friend that she knows in the industry as if francia is not an actress herself and then some people were trying to say oh well she meant the music industry you know Fan francia is not in the music industry so it's the truth but me personally I thought that that was absolutely bogus to say because they were basically putting words in Selena Gomez's mouth, trying to make her mean something that she didn't specifically say that she meant. Like, it was really disgusting how far some people were going to justify her not mentioning her friend. And then when they when people brought it up so much on Twitter, Selena Gomez basically responded by saying, oh, well, I can't, I'm sorry for not mentioning every single person I know. And a lot of people were saying, Francia is not just some everybody you know. She's literally your best friend, or supposedly, who gave you her kidney. There's some respect that's needed there. And it's not too much to ask. She's not, like I said, she's not asking her to mention her every waking moment. She's not asking her to like hold, you know, trying to hold it over her head. It's just when people go out of their way to do stuff like that for you, like, you just don't you don't you don't not mention them you don't just forget to give them credit like that's just something that you don't do and a lot of people are looking at her in a different light since she said that and another thing that was brought up that disturbed me was back when all this was happening which was like i think 10 years ago or something like that basically francia had went to the doctor to see if she was a match for selena gomez whenever selena confided in her when all this was first going down about her health problems she just said out of the kindness of her heart being her best friend Okay, well, I'll, I'll go and see if I'm a match so that if by any chance I am, maybe I can help you. Now, by law, doctors are supposed to tell the potential donor um, first if they're a match. They told Selena Gomez that she was a match. And she found out about this when Selena called her and said, hey, we're a match, which was a slap in the face and illegal. She should have sued whoever that doctor was into the ground because... Like I said, that was illegal for her to do. And Selena Gomez really should be ashamed of herself for doing her friend like that. The reason why they make it to where the donor knows first is so that they won't have pressure from the person who may be, you know, the recipient. And I feel like that luxury was taken from her when they did that. And I feel like, you know, like I said, I believe she did it because she cared about the girl. But, you know, the encouragement was that she already knew that she was a match. So she figured, oh, well, she knows I'm a match. Like, we're friends. Might as well go through with it. And that really, that's really messed up when you think about it. And now that I think about it over the years, I really only heard about, like, this whole situation with her giving her the kidney like i said back in the day when this all happened like she made a post i remember when she made a post you know they were in the hospital bed and she was saying oh my friend you know donated a kidney and i was like oh wow that's really nice of her and it's really to my knowledge all i ever remember her even mentioning about that if somebody that i know that cares about me gives me a, a kidney first of all you better believe anybody asks me about anything the first person who i'm gonna give thanks to is god and then i'm gonna be like and then my friend who donated their kidney you know what i'm saying because 
she's basically alive because of that but then like i said an even bigger slap in the face if i remember correctly a lot of the reasons why she was having those health problems um they were enhanced by stuff like drinking and not taking care of herself properly and after she got the kidney she was still drinking that made me mad i was like really because you know people will say stuff like oh well i can do whatever i want to if i want to drink i can drink no you can't do whatever you want to when your body is on a ticking time clock and your health is trash and whatever you're doing is going to make it go to the trash more and people are giving their kidney to you to help you no you don't get to just do whatever you want to do it's all gonna be fun and games until she need another organ that's all i'm gonna say about that but this whole situation, like I said, a lot of people are like disappointed in Selena Gomez. And they're like, uh-uh, she seems like one of those one of those types of celebrities that uses you for what you can get, then tosses you aside. And I have to agree, I really think she did fancy a dirty, but that's just my viewpoint. Like I said, I always invite people to say what they feel down in the comments. Um, but this just goes to show sometimes even when you you know really care about somebody you love somebody there are just certain things you cannot do for people okay and i'm not saying all people you know you might want to go out your way to help somebody to do something for somebody that you care about but you need to make sure like y'all need to make sure who y'all going out of y'all way for who y'all bending over backwards for actually cares about you the same way you care about them and would do the same thing for you that you're doing from them like that's where a lot of people get messed up at they go out of their way they go the distance for somebody who they care about but they don't realize this person does not feel the same way and they come up with all kinds of piss poor excuses to justify just being an awful person being selfish not doing for you what you would do for them and not really loving you the way you love them y'all gotta be careful out here man before you do anything drastic like that you need to pray about it you need to seek some counsel you need to make sure you're thinking with a clear mind give yourself some time unfortunately she didn't have that time because like i said before the doctor didn't even tell her that she was a match first she told selena which was like i said illegal and messed up so she didn't exactly have that time she had the pressure she didn't have time and she even said in the um the video that she was speaking about you know francia was speaking about the whole ordeal that basically a lot of the stuff that was supposed to take months for her to do to really prep and get ready and decide to do the transplant she did it in a day that was ridiculous in itself like i said somebody should have been in francia's corner like ready to sue the entire hospital but anyways like i said my my main point is make sure you know who you're going out of your way for and that they actually deserve it that they deserve your love because there are some people who don't and there's some people who do you gotta know who those people are get some counsel pray about it y'all gotta be careful out here man y'all tell me what y'all think down in the comments below